let me show you fellas now why your rain is not working we're gonna cover and it will be quite long so we're gonna cover absolutely every single thing some of you might have a minor issues you might forgot to enable it here and there some of you might have done another mistake and some of you might have screwed up so or pure installations which is insanely common uh, like people contact me on a daily basis that their so and pure is not working or something like that and they work directly with rain so if you screw up so on pure installation I can guarantee that your rain will not be working. You hear the noise of rain, there will be no rain, something like that. Now, first thing, fellas, you go to settings, Acero Corsa applications, and make sure all your soul applications are enabled. You can see four apps. If you don't have four applications right here, because I've seen that, that means you screwed up the soul installation and you're missing an application. I've seen people installing on the pure. You need so, guys. Remember, install so on pure. You need both. Then, if your apps are enabled and that's out of the way, another thing that you might have forgotten, fellas, is particle effects. Make sure your particle effects is enabled because otherwise you might not see raindrops. This could be another possibility. The third possibility, fellas, that you have missed something or screwed up is that your weather effects is not activated or is just old controller scripts, old weather script. So make sure when you open here, you're using the final controller script, the latest one. And when you open here, you're either using the latest so or the latest pure, depending if you have the paid version of pure, of course. So I'm using pure because I have the paid version, right? And uh, basically that's that. Make sure your uh, extra effects is very good to have. Uh, so make sure this is uh, turned on as well. Now. Once this is out of the way, fellas, and you have uh, enabled post-processing filters, everything is in check here in the video. Now, it only leaves us that your rain effects and your rain in general is not working because you screwed up the soul and pure installations. I'm going to show you now how to fix that. I know for the most of you, fellas, you're probably pretty annoyed that in every guide I'm showing up that so on pure uh, uninstallations and uh, reinstallations uh, i do understand that but it is what it is these are the core mods of everything csp so pure these these they just go hand to hand if you screw up one thing it will screw up the other thing so now without further ado let's say if you hear only rain sound or your rain is not working at all we're going absolutely on a full cleanup at the moment what we're gonna do first first fellas is I'm going to delete my CSP. So I'm going to delete CSP. Then I'm going to close Content Manager. Now we're going into So. I'm going to uninstall So and Pure. So first we're going to start with So. Now, you see, we're going to open the archive. We're going to open So. Then we want this So uninstall bat, which a lot of people ask me, but I don't have So uninstall bat. Let's say you have So here. If you don't have any of these mods, don't worry. This will be the easiest part for you. You can just install them uh, once I finish an installing. Now, if you don't have this so and install bat, you can just do 200 IQ trick, grab this file, drag and drop it here. It's just a script to uninstall so, and then replace. If it asks you to replace or not, then run so and install bat. It is, it's gonna ask you to, do you want to delete your so configs? Press no, we wanna save our configs. There you go your soul is now deleted now what you can do is you grab these files and now we're going to install soul so once we've deleted it grab all these files drag and drop right here wait a bit replace boom there you go so is installed please fellas make sure to follow step by step one-on-one -on -one what i'm doing do not do things on your own if you don't know what you're doing this is how to install safely and manually bulletproof these mods without screwing up something now it's pure open your pure if you have pure purchase this is for the people that have pure purchased so once you've purchased pure now we need to find uninstall pure bat now again if you don't have uninstall pure bat grab this file drag and drop it right here and uh, we just need it to uninstall stuff so and i'll explain why i do it this way this is the safer way i'm doing it in the most optimal way that is going to work for absolutely every single one of you run the uninstall pure bat now we're going to find our folder 
for Cerro Corsa. Then we're going to go to games, Steam, Steam apps, come on, a Cerro Corsa. Boom. Here is an install. Absolutely the same thing. Grab all these files, drag and drop them into an empty space. Make sure it's empty space. Drag and drop. Wait a bit. There we go. Place. Okay, so we've installed all these thingies and let's see if we did our job correctly. We're gonna open our content manager. And now we're gonna, before we check everything, we will install CSP because I've deleted it. It's very important to also reinstall your custom shader patch. We're doing a full mod cleanup, fellas. I'm telling you, this is an absolutely 100% fix of your stuff. I can guarantee you, you've screwed up somewhere. It's 100% user error every single time. There has not been a person from all these hundreds of people that came to my Discord to ask for help. I've gone in the, their PC or with screen share or team viewer and I fixed their game. It works every single time you can literally ask the people that texted in the general chats or uh, stuff and you'll see I, I've fixed every single rain issue. Now, once we've installed CSP, make sure to update to the latest version. Then we're going to install Lights Patch. Grab this file here and drag and drop it right here. Again, if it gives us, can't install two things at once, fellas. Of course, you can just close this, right-click Content Manager, right-click again, Run as administrator. My screen goes black because it asked me to uh, allow it. Now we're running Content Manager in administration mode. Then you click these three dashes, install from a file, and you select Lights Patch 180 Preview 115. You open it here, then go again back here, install. That's how you install in just in case it doesn't allow you. Content Manager gives you the problem. Can't install two things at once. Now, let's see if we did our job correctly, fellas. Now we're going to go. We make sure that we have the latest CSP version. We have preview version, which contains rain effects. So now we're going to check. Rain effects is on. Particle effects is on. Let's see if we installed so on pure correctly. We're going here on weather effects. Boom. Latest controller script. Boom. We have pure, the latest one, and we have so. So everything seems absolutely perfect. Now let's check the other stuff. We have rain effects, particle effects, then we have extra effects, everything's on. Everything seems on. Let's check our applications. We're gonna go to a set of Corsa apps and let's check. So, so weather app, so config, so custom weather, and so planner are on. So as well, of course, make sure enable Python apps is clicked. So it's ticked as well. So you can even touch these applications. Then we're gonna go to video. Make sure if you're using pure, just use one of the pure PP filters. If you're using so, just check the, the so PP filters or uh, or whatever, whatever PP filters you are using. Now for the people that drive in third person, make sure fellas to go here in the rain effects option, check chase cameras and make sure this is enabled. Another important thing, make sure FX AA is enabled and as well with the chase camera here, the small or large drops are enabled as well so that you can have a rain as well. Make sure to check out these options right here, disable for screenshots and other stuff so that you can make sure your rain is not disabled. Now, fellas, once everything is out of the way, we're gonna go to drive and we're gonna test the rain. Now, before we jump into the wet mode, fellas, we're gonna go ahead and test if our rain is working. My biggest important advice is use original Kunus car I'd advise you to even use the same car as I do. It's called a Bart. I call this the doggy car because it literally looks like a dog. It has these red mirrors as the ears and stuff. Now, you pick a Bart 500 CAC or whatever it's called. Then you pick Spa and we're going to go ahead now in the game and check everything. Why I advise you, by the way, to use this car is because some cars that are modded, they do not support particle effects. They don't have the script. And everything to support uh, the raindrops on the windshield. You might see them on the side, but not on your front windshield. So make sure this is working properly. That's why we are going to use a Kunus original car. All right, fellas, we're into the game. So let's see now if our rain is working. So what you want to do is you want to go here on the top right. You want to click on all apps. And we need a pure config and the pure soul planner. So once we have the pure soul planner, 
and uh, we are using of course an uh, original pure pp filter or any other pp filter how to enable your pure just in case you don't know is by going to clouds and make sure clouds render method is one now once this is out of the way you have your pure everything enabled you want to click on the soul planner right here you can close this by clicking again so you want to open this and we're going to click on heavy thunderstorm so let's see what's going to happen fellas do we have rain we are even going to increase this to maximum rain amount 100 percent i'm going to put the wetness to maximum fellas there we go as you can see fellas we have rain perfectly working and you can see that even we have audio everything is working